Are you excited to go home and go ahead? Are you excited to kind of get home and will you see family or have you talked to anybody? Have they been calling you up and kind of what's your thoughts going on in this last regular season game? Um, yeah, yeah it has been a lot of, you know, I mean, obviously I'm from there, but it's not, it's like 30 minute drive from my house. So, um, yeah, a lot of people, a lot of friends, family, you know, they have been contacting me like, hey, we need some tickets. Right. Like, I don't know, you know, so, but yeah, it'll be cool, it'll be cool experience. And, and I don't know what, what the record's like since they lost here. I'm guessing they probably haven't lost more than a game. What makes them so tough? Um, just the intensity that they play with, really. They, they play really hard for 40 minutes every game, so um, that's one you know you got to get them for, for sure. You got to really uh, go go in for that one. Jamar Taylor still in the Denver City Ohio game? I do not know. Um, as of right now, I only have four tickets, so I mean, I don't know what to tell everybody else. <laughs> uh, we'll, I'll try to figure something out, but right now, yeah, I don't, you know, we got TVs. Does it mean a lot for you to be able to go and play in your home city? Um, uh, yeah, it's cool. Uh, yeah, it's cool. You know, high school, I mean, I talked to Houston a little bit. Um, they never offered me, which was kind of weird, but, you know, that's whatever, you know, I don't really have too much to say about them. So is it too old in your mind then? Just not having that level of interest or is it something you've sort of gotten past at this point? Uh, no, I will forever remember that. Um, yeah, any Texas school, really, anyone, they all remember the same type of vibe for me, for sure. Did you visit there? Uh, no, but they, they've been to my, Houston has been my high school maybe like four times. They came and watched me practice. You guys have lost, I think, two straight before the K-State game. How important was it for you guys to win that game the way you did? Oh, yeah, especially that one. Um, we had to because, we, you know, the thing, the, the motto is not make one, two, and we made one, two, so we really had to bounce back. But that was a big, big win for us. As someone who's coming off the bench, in some of the recent games, we saw those mass substitutions, you know, three or four people going out at once. What do you think of that, and what's it been like for you being part of a unit that comes in at a different time? You yeah, know, I think that's like really cool, actually. Um, quite helpful, you know. Uh, the reserves to obviously uh, do their job, help the starters, get a little rest, uh, hold on weight, carry on weight, and uh, it grows confidence as well because you know you gotta show up, or you know you're gonna have to show up. So uh, yeah, I really, uh, I like I like the. Uh, what do you think of playing the number one team in the country on their court? Um, when we played UConn, were they number one? No, Houston was number one. No, I'm saying when we played UConn, were they? No, they were number four. They were four? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, I mean, it, regardless of what the ranking is, it's, I know it's a hard, it's going to be a hard game. So, um, whatever the rankings is, it doesn't really mean anything. But, yeah, that would be. Can, can you put your finger on team-wide confidence right now? You know, Kevin's back. Nick had a game the other night that yeah. people have been waiting to see. What, where do you put your team's confidence right now? Uh, yeah, I feel like we're really, we're, we're getting there for sure. I know it's late in the season, but this is when you really want it to click for real. So, um, yeah, no, this is, this, is a, this is the perfect time for everything to kind of get to click. Does it feel different? Are you, are you feeling a difference? Yeah, I'm s super excited, really. Yeah. Uh, can't wait. To see uh, Nick, to see, uh, see what he can do. Uh, no, we know Kevin's gonna come with it every game. Hunt, you know, our Juan, KJ, uh, they all do their thing. So, yeah, super excited, especially there at Houston. When you were little, did you follow Houston or the NBA more? Did you follow uh, the Cougars? like the Cougars? Nah, not really. I didn't really. That wasn't really my thing. Um, I don't think anybody. Well, my mom went to the U of H, but she didn't play basketball, so I mean, it wasn't like, I didn't really care for them. So. Jamar, right. how would you describe your, your season? What's it been like for you? Um, this has been a, this has been a, you know, a journey, it's a process, and um, learning how to, I can say, be a professional, I guess, be ready, always. Um, but yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm loving, my, loving my process for sure. All right, so